A fire in the East Bay shut down traffic and caused black smoke to billow into the afternoon sky. It happened at the 7-Eleven store on East 14th Street in San Leandro. That fire is now out, but the smell of burning chemicals is still being felt in the air. KTVU's Crystal Bailey arrived just as firefighters were fighting those flames. Witnesses say the fire started as a burning bush. I was just coming out from Popeye's, and then I saw the guy, he had leaned down, started the fire, and then he walked that way. Doug Holland says he started recording, catching the employees of the 7-Eleven on East 14th Street trying to put out the flames. He tried to put the fire out with a fire extinguisher, but he couldn't get it out. And then that's when the whole 7-Eleven got fired. Minutes later, firefighters arrived just before 12.30 in the afternoon. Witnesses watched them wash down the bush, but the flames ended up spreading. The fire spread quickly. It was a heavy smoke producer because it's a commercial structure. It's the type of smell that there's like chemicals in the air too, not just like a brush fire or something like that. The fire moved from outside, up the roof, and inside the store, causing everything inside to burn. The two people in the 7-Eleven left the building before fire crews arrived, and thankfully, no one was injured. Schools nearby were ordered to shelter in place, and streets were closed to traffic because of the thick smoke. We did ask for all the people in the area to stay out of the smoke's flow and not breathe any of this in. I want to clarify that witnesses did not capture pictures or video of the person who allegedly started the fire. The fire is still under investigation, and officials are working with the witnesses to describe what they saw. It has not been ruled as arson. Now, the owner of the 7-Eleven declined to comment, but obviously this is a total loss for the store. Thankfully, no one was injured. In San Leandro, Crystal Bailey, KTVU, Fox 2 News.